All right, so sneaker essentials. These are products that I use and things that I do on a weekly basis that have me enjoying my sneakers a little bit more. I've got five things for you right now, no fluff. We're getting right into it, so let's do it. Okay, first up, I'm gonna be real brief because it's kind of obvious, but there are still some people that need to hear this. The most important essential for your sneakers is your outfit. When you're wearing a $200 pair of Jordans and you're rocking your men's rec league jersey and some shorts or some sweatpants that you've had since the eighth grade, it just is lopsided. It doesn't look right, it doesn't look put together, and when you wear sneakers with an outfit that is fully coordinated, not only does it change the appearance of your sneakers, but your entire look. It says everything about you when you're on point and you look sharp and you're expressing yourself. Okay, for these next two, we're gonna talk a little bit about the elements. Right now, it's December. It's cold. When it's chilly and it's raining or it's snowing and your feet are cold, you need to step up your sock game, which brings us to today's video sponsor, which is Bombas. When my toes and my feet are freezing and I have to be outside, there is nothing more essential than a merino wool sock. I am urging you guys, if you have not tried out merino wool socks yet, you got to. It is an absolute game changer and essential if you wanna wear your sneakers in the winter time, which a lot of us do. Boots are, are nice. Some days you just have to wear boots, I get it, but you just wanna wear sneakers. They're easier on the go, they tend to look better, so I wanna wear sneakers, but if it's 20 degrees out, I need some extra warmth. Not to mention the different colors and patterns that Bombas offers for these merino wool socks. So you can get festive with it. If you cuff the end of your jeans and you can see the socks a little bit and you wanna show off a pattern or you wanna show off a cooler earth tone rather than just a crisp white or a black, you can do that and you can stay cozy. And if you don't know by now, for every pair that Bombas sells, they donate a pair to a homeless shelter. So it's not only just cold for you right now, so think about the people that need new socks. People that are in homeless shelters that can't accept used goods. Bombas donates a brand new pair every time you buy one, so keep that in mind. Bombas has provided me with a promo code that you guys can use with the link down below on these merino wool socks. Go ahead, take advantage. You'll get 20% off by using my promo code. Enjoy. All right, and sticking with that winter theme, when it is snowing or it is raining and you wanna keep your feet dry, inside you got the merino wool socks. You're good, you're warm. Outside of that are whatever pair of sneakers that you're wearing. Sometimes you just wanna protect those. And I went ahead and I grabbed these UGG guards that a lot of people are hyping up. I don't think that these look good per se, but I think that they are very essential for when it rains or when it snows and you wanna protect your sneakers, especially if you're wearing something that's suede or a new buck or a really soft leather, you gotta protect that. So these UGG shoe guards are essentially just rubber. There's nothing new with these. This idea has been around, but this is just Uggs version where you get a little bit of a grippy bottom on there. They look like a pair of boots. I truly don't care how these look, but we've all been there. We go to step out of the car and it is snowing or raining. All of a sudden we have a good pair of shoes on. Some of you have probably tied bags around your sneaker, like plastic grocery bags and just tried to protect them any way you can. When you have something like this in your car, just in the trunk, and you can throw it on real quick, it truly is essential. Okay, next up, this is kind of on the organization side or just promoting wearing your sneakers because I think that is very important. I don't like it when my shoes just sit in the closet. So by one of my doors, I keep this little sneaker rack. It probably holds six pairs, if that. And I put the shoes I wanna wear for that week on that rack. I did not want to spend a lot of money because I didn't need anything too glamorous. It fits the bill. I think this was maybe 30 or 40 bucks. It was cheap. I like it because I can walk to the door wearing a pair of slippers or something and I'm like, okay, these are my six options. Instead of looking at my entire collection and being like, what do I want to wear today? I'm wasting time. I can look at six pairs that I've already pulled out and go from there. So I think it's really essential for saving some time and actually wearing your shoes 
every Sunday night, grab six pairs that you're gonna throw on that rack and then have Saturday or Sunday be a wild card. Try it out, trust me. Okay, last up, this one's interesting. Take it with a grain of salt. You might not necessarily need these, but they are helpful, but proceed with caution. We've got some sneaker stretchers or whatever you wanna call them. There are so many that are on Amazon and I can't vouch for them all. I can't, I don't even wanna vouch for these guys right here because they are dangerous. What they do is they make your shoes a little bit wider and they can stretch them out lengthwise. They are essential to me for basketball shoes and also other sneakers that I just have bought the wrong size with. I can't get my size, I'm stuck with a size 11 when my true size is an 11 and a half or just certain shoes that run snug. They don't work with every single sneaker. They can mess your shoes up, blow them out, like proceed with caution, trust me. But it is nice to have these around when you just wanna stretch your shoes a little bit. Let me know down in the comment section what are essential for you guys. Save some money on Bomba socks by using my promo code, those Merino wools. So nice, so soft, so warm. <laughs> The link is in the description for that and my promo code. Please hit that thumbs up if you found these tips helpful. Subscribe if you're new around here. Thank you guys. I'll catch you next time. Peace.